Just looking for more of an update on what ESS has been doing um, to assess whether and to what extent Scotland is keeping pace with EU environmental standards. Um, Dr Dixon, you helpfully mentioned the example of ecocide law and there's been big developments um, even in the last week. I'm just looking at my notes now. The European Parliament press release from about six days ago um, talked about environmental crime now being the fourth largest criminal activity worldwide. So it's no surprise that the EU has been taking action to approve new rules on environmental crime, crimes that are comparable to ecocide and there's new related sanctions. So the Scottish Government is aware of this and has told me that they are continuing to monitor this. But that's now come into, into, into force. So is that, is that an example where there is live discussion between um, your shells in ESS and the Scottish Government. We're also seeing proposed legislation in the House of Lords as well as a private member's bill on ecocide. So is that an example where we're seeing a bit more activity? It's, it's absolutely an area that we're discussing with the Scottish Government in terms of um, obviously your own work, Ms Lennon, and also sort of what are the development which is happening kind of in Europe. So yes, that is very much a conversation that we're having with government. 